It's a beautiful day here in Minnesota. Um, Tesla's been gone for, I think, about two days now, and I'm um, really <laughs> not doing very well with it, but um, I can keep from crying now, so I guess it's an improvement. Um, I went to the store today. Uh, grocery store because there's this stupid thing going on in Minnesota where the Republicans and the Democrats can't get together and agree on dick. And because of this, people like me and others who deserve to have um, help and state assistance um, are getting fucked. And when I mean fucked, I mean like bend me over without the KY jelly and just slam her home because um, we lose all of our benefits on the first because these assholes can't come to a compromise. Um, so I went and I, I had to buy um, food with my food stamp since obviously next month because these public food fucktards can't get together and come to an agreement, um, I get screwed and I can't afford food this month. So I went out and bought as much as I could. Um, with Tessa not being here, it'll be a lot easier, you know, I won't have to worry about food for her. I mean, I can go without eating for a while. I'm a big girl, I can live off my fat, but um, that's what's going on in this fantastic state. Thank God they're keeping medical for elderly and children, but the rest of us all have to pay a pay into um, the medical, which means we still can't afford it. So, <laughs> um, Unless they figure out and pull their heads out of their asses by the first, which is in, what, two days? Um, we're all in for a very rude awakening. Um, they've cut funding for everything. The whole state of Minnesota is going to go into this little hibernation state for six weeks. So, um, enjoy your vacation, you fucking assholes. Um, let's see what else. Oh, um, while I was out, I, um, I couldn't help but get Tessa's stuff. Um, I'm going to mail it to her. Uh, I got her the matching one of this necklace. It's two peas and a paw. It's cute. It's uh, best friends necklace. It's the only one that I couldn't find that said best friends. It said two peas in a pod. So um, I thought, what better? She could wear a necklace and remember me. I also got her a singamajig. She likes these things and they are quite possibly one of the creepiest children's toys you can buy right now. Um, have you ever seen a singamajig? no or yes and I just answered no for you well um hold on let me show you something okay this where is it this is a singamajig Singamajigs look like they have hair ties around their lips or something. They've got like big DSLs. If you don't know what DSLs are, go down to Urban Dictionary and take a look for yourself. But um, it when you squeeze it, they sing. This one, there's three different settings. This one sings. Uh, let me call you sweetheart. Hold on, I need some. 
Yes? Sure. Why not? There you go. So it'll be two things. I my daughter calls me Mama Kangaroo. Oh, let me get this stupid thing off here. Sorry. My daughter calls me Mama Kangaroo. Bye. My daughter calls me Mama Kangaroo. She's my baby kangaroo. You know, the whole All right. So I was out looking for a kangaroo stuffed animal, and obviously, <laughs> and brainerd you aren't going to find a kangaroo you probably have to go into the twin cities to the um rainforest cafe in the mall of america but yeah look at here there's two peas in a pod and it says upside down So, there you go. I'm going to send those to her, make me feel a little bit better, and hopefully she enjoys them. Um, work is going well. Work is work. And, um, I mean, what can you expect from the phone sex industry? You get guys calling you for stuff. And, um, all right, so in the, the problem that we're having right now is it's, what, 4th of July week, and everyone's probably having a family reunion of some sort. So things are a little bit slow at this point in time, um, but I can tell you as soon as 4th of July is over, we're going to have a influx of horny guys calling for, um, a good time. We love you long time. So, um, it's kind of boring right now. Um, I'm reading, and there's Bunny. Where is she? There she is. Bunny! <laughs> what a dork. <sighs> Anyways, um, where was I with the horny guys? So you're gonna, we're gonna have an influx of horny guys, and right now it's boring. Oh, yes, I remember. I'm reading a book. Um, I'm reading a couple of books, and I'm knitting. Um, yes, my inner 87-year-old woman has come out to play since Tessa's left, you know. Um, eh, that's about it. So... There you go, and um, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.